everyone and welcome to Unstoppable Bonus Gaming. Today we are doing another card opening pack. Today's pack is the Mystery Power Box. I got this from Walmart, guys. I've opened two of these in the past. I got a my mystery item and those two packs. I got the card album, the small one, and I also got the an old pack from uh, Diamond and Pearl first release, I don't know. But in today's video, we are gonna see what we get. Hopefully we get something really good. I'm not gonna show you the mystery item until the very end of the video. If you wanna go ahead and skip to that, you can. But if you wanna watch the whole thing, just go ahead and sit back and relax and enjoy today's video, guys. I thank you so much for watching. Let's go ahead and get this started. Here is the mystery power box. As you can see here, you get the one mystery item, the five booster packs, two online code cards, one foil card, and two coins. This is a really good deal. I think it's about $25. Uh, I don't know where else they're at besides Walmart, because I haven't really seen them anywhere else. Uh, I might have saw some at Toys R Us, but I don't think so. I don't know. Um, I will show the mystery item once again at the end of the video. If you just want to skip to that, you can, but I would uh, prefer that you show the whole video. Don't forget to leave a like, guys. Let's go ahead and get this thing opened up. All right, guys, that is now out of the wrapper. And we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna open the box. The box just opens from the top here. Get this hatch down and then you open up this thing. Be sure not to show you guys our mystery item. Okay, here's what it looks like. The mystery item goes right here, just in case you're wondering. But this is what it looks like on the inside. Um, the company that did this did a really bad job. You'll see in all videos of this that they just took it and they just glued everything all together. So I'm gonna <laughs> just take all of this off of here if I can get all this. All right there, as you can see, we got one big floppy mess of packs. Um, you have the two coins here, which is Finnegan and Froki. They're pretty cool. Um, you also get a promo foil card, which I have not seen yet. And it is a Charizard, which actually looks pretty cool. Let's look at that close. Holographic Charizard, which is pretty sick. Um, uh, before in these, I've got a Blast Toys. And I think I got another Blast Toys, another one. Um, but here is a code for this, so you guys can go ahead and enter this code. So the first thing we're going to open, I think I want to go with Gengar and Phantom Forces because the first EX card I ever pulled was a Gengar EX, Mega Gengar EX anyways. So this will be the first one that I would want to pull. <clears throat> here is the code for you guys. We got three from the back. And let's get this video started. We're gonna start off with a steel shelter. Next up, we got, let me focus this in. We got Target Whistle, Kingler, Gligar, Joltik, Yanma, Gulpin, Spearow. Oh, this is a reverse hollow Loudred. Sorry for messing up on the cards a little bit, not that great. And our final call. Oh, that is a hollow. A holographic for Alligator, which is actually pretty good. I'm gonna set this buddy back here. I actually like that card a lot. That is pretty cool. Okay, the next pack we're going to open up is... Uh, we have two Rayquazas. I think we should open one Rayquaza now and another one later. Uh, which one do you guys think? Shiny, not shiny. Uh, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a tiger by the shiny. Shiny Rayquaza first. Because I, I, like, I like shiny Rayquaza. Rayquaza is actually my favorite legendary Pokemon ever. And... Uh, Oh my god, I almost forgot the question of the day, guys. If you'll notice, I had these two evolutions here beside me. And I decided that today's question of the day is... <clears throat> if you could pick any of the evolutions to evolve your Eevee into, which one would you pick out of all of them? Go ahead and comment down below and tell me what you got, or what you want. Okay, we got Rotom, Combi, Relicanth, Meowth, an Eevee, speaking of Eevee, Porygon, Reverse Vileplume, and our final card is... Oh my god. No. Oh my god. Oh. No. No way. There is no way we got this, guys. Look at that. Let me get this up close. What in the world is this? This card is disgusting. This is this is actually the most beautiful card I've ever pulled in my entire life. This is one of the greatest... This is, I, need, I need to get some sleeves. I don't have any sleeves on me. We're going to have to sit it back here for now. I knew Shiny Rayquaza would come in, come in good for us, but we got what we got, man. I think we should just go ahead and go with Rayquaza again. I'm just, I'm just feeling lucky with Rayquaza, dude. I'm feeling lucky with the Rayquaza. All right. There's the code. One, two, and three from the back. Let's go ahead and see what we can get this time. Okay, we got Executor, Trainer's Mail. We got Manectric, Voltorb, Pikachu, Wurmple, Bagon, Binacle, 
Reverse Firo, and the final card is a Victini. Victini's pretty cool. Uh, but let's go ahead and get to the next pack. All right, now it's down to our last two packs, guys. We have Kangaskhan or Eveltal. Which one do you guys think deserve it more? I really like Kangaskhan, so I'm going to leave him for last. Kangaskhan, you, you're the greatest man. Eveltal might have him for us. I don't know this Eveltal pack feels pretty light, to be honest. So I don't, don't really know if I'm feeling it from this Eveltal pack. There's that code. Um, I really like Xerneas a lot better than Eveltal anyways. I've always been a Zern Dog fan. Uh, for alligator, or if I say for alligator, for all good here, Mr. Mime, Girdor, Bidoof, Skiddo, Panseer, Pone Edge, Spoink, and our reverse holo roller skates. And our final card is oh, actually a holographic card, which is pretty sick. We got an Aegis Slash here. This is a card I've never seen before. This is, this is cool. We got we got three cool cards. Now let's see if we can finish this with at least one EX Pokemon. Oh, I really love Flashfire. I think Mega Charizard is in Flashfire. I have Mega Charizard Y. Um, really want a Mega Charizard X card. That would be the coolest thing I can get from this. But we'll see. We'll see what we got. We'll see what the god, what the god Pokemon gods think about us today. From this final thing, I'm already happy with the full art card we got. But if we got something else just to end it on, would be so cool. Okay, we got the Pal Pad. We got Cilio, Lissandre, Flabebe, Sandile, Bergmite, Pineco. We got a Sphil. Let me focus that in. And we got a Roselia for our holographic card. And our final card is. Oh, actually, another holographic. It's still a carbink, but it's still okay, you know? That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Let's go ahead and do a recap of what we got. From opening the packs, the cool cards that we got, we got this holographic Aegislash, we got a holographic Carbink, we got the holographic Feraligator, and then we got the full art Mega Sceptile, which looks crazy insane. This is going in my collection and never leaving. I love this card. But now guys, it is time to see the secret item that you guys have all been waiting for. Today's secret item from the mystery power box is this which I already have, which isn't that great. I was hoping it was one of the graded cards, but you know what, it is okay. Maybe even an extra pack, but an extra pack would've been still, still would've been awesome. But this is still cool. Getting a mystery item is always fun. But that's it for today's video, guys. If you did enjoy this video, do not forget to leave a like, subscribe, or comment, guys. And I will see you next time on a Supplemental Gaming Sceptile. Say bye. Mm -hmm.